96.5 WKLH 623 right now. Dave, Carol, KB, and I think uh, what we're proving today, especially with Senator Barack, you know, sitting right next to KB over there, is that uh, really you are bringing the nation together. Because, right. you know, KB, uh, I think we kind of know where he stands on issues. And, and frankly, Not anymore, uh, you don't. And, and frankly, <laughs> You two seem to be hitting it off pretty well. Well, we, we, we can change. And I, I, I'm looking at KB now, and I, I can sense he wants change. You know, he, it, he does. I'm, I'm going to take him from Mequon to Parkland, and <laughs> we're going we're gonna to definitely see if, see, he, if he can handle the difference. Senator Barack, what he's afraid of, what he's afraid of is that if you do indeed become president, all he will have left is change. Okay, so that's, that's kind of the big issue there. K, K, KB, l- let me say this. My plan is clear. Once again, the website, Marlon Barack Hill. <laughs> and it, it states right there, I'm gonna, I, I have a pregnancy test plan. It's, it's 99.9% taxes are going to be cut. <laughs> I'm telling you. And KB, you don't have to worry about anything because you're not making $250,000 yet. So it doesn't affect you. Okay. I'm so sold. Look, look at the pregnancy, plus, uh, pregnancy test plan, and trust me, you, you will be running to the poll November 4th, especially <laughs> standing in the uh, Barack line. Okay. <laughs> now, do they do lines like that? I don't know. They should have, like, a little line. Barack line over here, <laughs> McCain line over here. This is a battle. It, it, it'll be even. <laughs> I'm, I, I, it, it will be even. <laughs> <laughs> So what do you think of McCain's choice of Sarah Palin? I mean, I think everybody's thinking she's a good choice for him, and a lot of people think she's hot. What do you, I know you're a happily married man. What about you? If, if Michelle's listening right now, <laughs> I'm going to ask you, honey, sweetheart, please turn the radio down. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. Sarah Palin is very attractive, uh-huh. but, but she also has some characteristics that I totally find intriguing. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you one of them. She, okay. she, anyone that's a, a hockey mom. Okay. I, I, I like someone that's going to give me a challenge. Okay. <laughs> she's a hockey mom, and, and she's a hunter. I mean, come on. Wisconsinites, we love to hunt. Uh-huh. And she, she likes to fish. Uh-huh. And I like to go fishing, too. Uh-huh. And I'm trying to catch something. Michelle, are you listening still? I'm just saying. <laughs> no, I think that was a very good choice. And, and you could tell from the convention, uh, McCain got a really big bounce because of he did. him announcing that. A couple Sarah of Palin. big bounces. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. he really did. So, um, speaking of McCain, Senator Barack, what is the the dumbest thing that John McCain has ever said? Uh, do you want my top ten? Uh, sh- <laughs> no, 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 I'm teasing. I'm teasing. <laughs> no, no, the first thing that comes to mind, I'm going to be honest with you, David, here. I mean, we all say some dumb things. I mean, we all do dumb things. I mean, I, I used to smoke and sell weed, but that's, that's in the past. <laughs> that's in the past. I'm just saying. That, that's in the past. I'm, I love I'm, that. I'm, what, what I'm saying is John McCain recently said, and I heard it, he said that Afghanistan hates America for our freedom. That's what John McCain said. He said Afghanistan hates America for our freedom. No, uh-huh. Afghanistan doesn't hate America for our freedom. They hate us for our hygiene. That's, That's what they do. They're <laughs> jealous of our hygiene. You ever go into one of the local stores? Come on, come on, Dave. You've been there. You ever smell one of these guys? They hate us for our hygiene. I'm, I'm just being honest. I just got to keep it real. I just got to tell it like it is. <laughs> keeping it real. I am definitely keeping it real, and we this election is far from over. We still got work to do. I'm telling you right now. The, and one other thing John McCain says, he said that our economy was fundamentally sound. Come on, Carol. Our economy fundamentally. You tell that to a young lady named Regina who lost her house to Katrina. Now she's staying in the failure by Trina. <laughs> Or FEMA, I'm sorry. Get the rhyme and I lose my work. But our economy is fundamentally sound. You tell John McCain to keep it real to that elderly woman in Springfield who can't afford her medicine, let alone a decent meal, that our economy is fundamentally sound. You tell John McCain, get us out this mess. They're trying to dissolve MPS, that our economy is fundamentally sound. <laughs> Marlon, that's fantastic. Uh, Marlon, uh, I appreciate you're so it. Marlon Barack. Thank you, Carol. You, you, you are lovely, too, honestly. If, if I hadn't have selected Joe Biden, you'd definitely be one of my running mates. Okay. I'd tell you that much. <laughs> hey, Marlon, you know what? We have not even told everybody that you used to come in on Comedy Cafe Day. That's exactly right. That's yeah, right. You, that's came, right, you came in, you're doing, uh, you, when you were doing, you still doing the stand up thing? I'm doing stand up. Yeah, I actually uh, got my start a few years back. I went out to the world famous 
Apollo Theater in Harlem, New York, and I made history by winning a record five consecutive weeks. Five weeks, yeah. Yep. And since then, I came here, and um, I remember working with uh, you and Carol, and you gave me an opportunity to come in and do some impressions. This is back in the Frank County, and was right before Frank got his big break. Yeah, um, we yeah. were at Stu, just like on Layton on the South Side. So, just wanted to spend, send a special shouts out to everybody that has supported me back then that are currently you know on my team today well i'll tell you what marlon we uh we're already getting tons of emails in here about your impression and we taped the entire thing it's going to saturday night that's what's up you did a great that's what's up great thank you i appreciate it thank you so you're so funny i appreciate it thank you awesome thank you and you know what when you hit the big time don't forget us little people who (laughs) <laughs> I'm just kidding. And yeah. now it begins. I got, I got you. I got you. Thanks, Dave. Thanks, it Dave. always happens. Thanks, Thanks Marlon. Hey, thank you so much, Marlon. And is that really is that really the website, Marlon Barack Hill? Marlon Hill is the website. Marlon Hill. Okay, Marlon Hill. Go to Marlon's website. Check it out. And uh, trust me, watch for him because he's going to be on one of those uh, Saturday Night Live shows. If not Saturday Night Live, then Fox uh, M- uh, Mad TV. We're thank getting you. it there too.